Latoya Montana, and I'm here to do a day in the life. <laughs> well, it is early in the morning. It's actually 8.25, and um, guess what? I was washing clothes because since I work overnight, I think my days and my nights are mixed up, so I wake up like I go to sleep really early, and then I wake up even earlier in the morning, and I wash clothes because I my kids come back today, so I was washing their comforters and their sheets. And I realized that my dryer went out. I'm so sad. So anyway, I went on offer up. I've been sending in, sending, well, looking for dryers all morning. Asking people, do they deliver? Because I really need somebody to deliver because I don't know anybody here. And um, yeah, so that's what I'm trying to do. Find me a dryer. But I'm about to go to the laundromat and dry this stuff because I had already washed it. And the kids come home today, so I gotta get together. Then I also got to go to journey school because I just transferred her yesterday. But um, I didn't take her birth certificate with me because they didn't tell me I needed her birth certificate. It was like all that would get sent over. And then when I went into school, the lady was like, well, I kind of would just want her birth certificate before I do that just to make sure you know you're the mom. Which I can understand that makes sense. But girl, trust me, I ain't adding on no more kids that ain't mine. And that's just that. But yeah, that's what I got to do this morning. I look a mess. Like, it just is what it is at the moment. And I'm thinking about cooking on the grill today for the kids when they get here. I just don't know, like, what time they're going to be here. And then, you know, I got to go to work tonight. So, I think I'm going to do that. But even if so, I'm going to cook on the grill early during the day. And I also want to get the kids, like, a welcome home sign and a, um some balloons. But I don't know if I have any money for that because... Y'all, yesterday, well, the day before yesterday, the bank actually uh, froze my debit cards. They said, like, a fraud or something. So, when I called and then I did everything, so they was like, they were going to ship me some out um, soon as possible, free. Girl, I'm not paying for y'all to ship me no cards out because it want no fraud. Y'all just crazy. And then... That's how much it'll get here Thursday. What? I need, like, overnight shipping. I don't have no cash. All my money is in the bank. Let me see. I might got a few dollars, and that's literally it. What's this? One, two. <laughs> I do not carry cash at once. When I first moved down here, now, I had <laughs> thousands of dollars of cash, but I didn't spend so much money. Y'all look right here. Girl, I got a ball spot. Oh, my. The ghetto. Anyway. Oh, yeah. I was supposed to get my hair braided, y'all. But can I tell y'all I got scammed? This is the second downtown. I done got scammed now from these fake hairstylists down here in Charlotte. And I done had enough. As a matter of fact, I'm doing my video on that today because enough is enough. Like, they scamming for pennies at this point. And it's just sad. What I got? And then I got, like, $700 on my cash out card. But that's my sister money. And I don't want to spend her money because I ain't going to want to pay it back. So, I got like $4 in cash, y'all. This is just ridiculous. But nonetheless, I'm going to go buy the kids some um some balloons and a welcome home sign. And me being me, I'm going to get some money from somewhere else because I'm going to put that out there in the, in the universe. Money flows to me easily. I will get unexpected money today. Thank you. So, anyway, and that's that. So, I'll let y'all know how that go. And when I get these unexpected funds, because we need some money. Like, it's Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Anything could happen. What if I need some gas? And it's been hot, so I ride with my AC on. And I had a half a tank of gas. And I had my AC on all yesterday. And I also did a haul yesterday. But I think I'm going to include it with this video because... It was real short. Like, I spent, like, over 400 something dollars at Sam's Club. But I didn't I didn't record at Sam's Club. I'm still kind of, like, I'm still nervous to record in public. <laughs> so, sometimes I'll pull my phone out and I'll record. And then a, a lot of other times I won't. But, hey, I don't know. So, whatever. That's neither here nor there. And I'm about to get in these streets and I'm going to take y'all with me. So, let's go.
y'all let me double check and see if my own um, My deep freeze won't work even though I drink the water, but it went not good. And I don't think it was cut off. <laughs> that is what's See how the food from the hall, y'all? So I made it to the laundromat and it is literally down the street from my house, like not even a whole four minutes. So yeah, let's go in here because I just need to dry this stuff right quick. Hopefully I'm not here for a long time and yes, my car needs to be clean, honey. But somebody need to do it because it just can't be me. But that's neither here nor there. And I'm putting my face mask on because I don't know how many of y'all don't know, but North Carolina is like in the top three for the COVID and that new Delta, whatever it is. My homegirl got it right now and she lived down here. And honey, I ain't trying to get it. And I'm also not trying to get no shot. So, yeah. That's okay because I've been wearing my face mask the whole time. Now, I do go out now. I be in these streets, you know, partying and clubbing and all that. But I wear my face mask and I do be in there sometimes and I take my face mask off or whatever. But majority of the time i wear my face mask because i don't have no problem with it and i do be hot and i do be sweating because i'm a fat girl or whatever but however it just is what it is it got to be done but you do what's best for you because i ain't judging because i'm just saying <laughs> Have a respect for Rita Franklin, but when you get done with this film, I want everyone to have a newfound respect for her. Mm, yeah. And Fred, what do you say? Because you work with Miss Franklin. Yes, yes. And mm -hmm. so, uh, what is your hope that people will, will come away with the film? Um, I'm hoping that the new generation coming up will say, wow, you know, that's time. That's, mm -hmm. you know, we have a lot of time, but. The blessing and stuff is in the dryer. But I realized when I pulled up, I said, don't I need money <laughs> to dry the clothes? I didn't even know how this worked because I've never been here before. And I haven't been in a laundromat in over a year. So good thing I had some change in my little cup holder. You know, we always put a little change down there. So I was able to find a dollar worth of change. They gave me 21 minutes in the dryer. Let's hope we don't need more than that because that's just that. <laughs> like, I don't know what I'm thinking about. Like, that's what I'm saying. That's why, like, you really don't understand how serious it is when you don't have, like, your bank card and you don't have cash. Like, now I see why the heck I need to have cash. Still need to have cash on me. <sighs> so now I'm going to start just taking a certain amount out of the atm every week when i get paid or whatever i got going on because this is a mess <sighs> but i don't know and i'm literally just sitting in the car with no thoughts at all i think i'm about to meditate while i'm in here meditate and then pray i think that's exactly what i'm about to do and I also tried to order me a tripod, but of course it declined. And I tried to order me like a car holder, whatever it is, but that declined. And I don't know. So I told my son to order it, and I hope he did order it. Because that's all I know. <laughs> but all right, y'all, I'm about to do a little meditating. I guess I got probably about 20 minutes now. And get my mind right for the day, because I didn't do it before I got here. Guys, they really... They have some good dryers because that 21 minutes actually work. <laughs> and those blankets, sheets, and everything is dry. So now I'm about to head to the school. Take this birth certificate.
Hey guys, so before I went into Harris Teaser, I could have sworn that I was recording. However, my storage was full and I had <laughs> to stop at the middle of the store and delete some of my videos. My blessings falling, as my aunt would say. I wish I had the little sprites for her little mini refrigerator. Mm -hmm. But I'll get her some hot dudes. Mm. I oh, these, I want to get one free. So that's Mountain Dew. If I get another Mountain Dew. Here, this is some shrimp. 
Then I'm gonna do like a little boil with shrimp corn and um shrimp corn and sausage. I got these kebabs, motherfucker, my steak kebabs. I got these ginger ales. That's for Miss Journey, little mini. No, this for me. This is for Journey's little mini refrigerator. Relish. I said I'm do some double eggs, but no, I mean I'm lying probably. I got these smoked sausage, cheese, to go on the burgers. This gonna go in the beans, cause y'all know I can't cook on the grill and not have beans. It's impossible. Buns, Miracle Whip. I got this Obey sauce, some green peppers, Heinz 57, and then I also got some um chicken wings. So. I guess I'm about to start. This is going to be, like I'm cooking on the grill for my kids for when they come home. This is like a welcome home to them. Um, however, they were supposed to come home today, but I'm not sure if they're going to come home today or tomorrow. So, whatever. Hey, guys. So, I put those hamburgers on the uh, grill. And I'm about to season this chicken. To us or whatever. And now, I don't even know if they're coming home today. They might not come home till tomorrow. But however, the food will still, it will still be some food left. Because y'all know my sister, my uh, my niece come around here. To eat, so. so, it'll be some food still left if they don't come home today. But I'm a little disappointed. So. <coughs> good, 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 good. Oh, child, they got a pepper. I'm very disappointed if they don't come home today. But, oh well. It is what it is. I know I didn't have to go get them or go meet them or whatever. But, anyway. Y'all had some grown kids. Like, I have a son. He just turned 21. And that thing he hollering. He grown, he grown, he grown about everything, right? But then gonna call me and say, Mom, you want to put some gas in my truck? Hell no, I don't want to put no gas in your truck. You grown, remember? Because I don't do that for grown men. But anyway, I done cashed up him the little dollars or whatever to put some gas in his truck. But he's so grown, though. It's just ridiculous. These children, they don't understand. That 18 means absolutely nothing. Oh, y'all, this is what I seasoned the um, chicken with the lemon pepper, garlic powder, this, this. So now I'm about to prep these beans and get those ready so I can throw them in the oven. And then this is how the chicken looking. And I got some sauce that I'm going to put on the chicken, but I'm going to grill it first. Then I'm going to sauce it, and then I'm going to put it back on the grill. I'm about to put some double eggs in this water. I just put salt in here. We just gonna let those come to a boil. I let mine cook for about 20 minutes. Okay, and set this oven on. Okay, bake it. And I'm gonna do 375. Start prepping for the beans. And I had the hot because we really like spicy food around here. <laughs> I, don't know. I always do that. Y'all, this is same, same, same. Let 
it's me. I did also Brown sugar. Yeah, we about to go check on these burgers. And these are the burgers that I got from Sam's Club yesterday. And they are so good. So they have the pound burgers. Y'all said I got me some new tongs from the Dollar Tree. Because <laughs> I really needed some new tongs. Miracle Whip. Y'all, I don't know no measurements. Like I said, I ain't even made this stuff in forever. You know you gotta shake your muscle. If not, it'll be all wet when it come out. I hate it. Ooh, that's enough. That's enough. <sighs> Sweet relish. Y'all think no beans done too. They didn't cut off. So, I got to check them. You're going to stir it up, stir it up, stir it up until it's like this. Nice, creamy, consistent base or whatever. You're going to taste it. Good. I put a lot of damn relish in there. I tell you that. It ain't that sweet though. Mm -hmm. Sprinkle a little bit of paprika. On it. Yeah, that they're not sweet enough for me, but whatever.
Hey guys, so basically I just got so tired after I put that chicken back on the grill and took it off. I ended up going, taking a shower and going to bed. Hope y'all enjoyed this vlog.